A wild scene in the Marriott Marina this weekend involving a local business owner and philanthropist who we've featured here on CBS 8. It ended with the man dropping his pants and screaming at a 21 year old employee on the dock in front of hundreds of onlookers. CBS 8's Anna Laurel joins us live from the marina right next to the Seaport Village with more on this story. Anna. That's right, you guys. It's pretty busy out here on a Monday afternoon, Monday evening. It's even busier on a Sunday afternoon when this all went down. There's a private dock here behind me. Not just anybody can pull up and use it. And when a worker told a man on a Lamborghini yacht yesterday that he couldn't use that dock, well, the guy on the yacht got a lot of attention for all the wrong reasons. When this four and a half million dollar Lamborghini yacht rolled into the Marriott Marina yesterday afternoon, everyone stopped to stare, take pictures and videos. One of those people was Joseph Holt, who works at the private dock here. But when the boat tried to pick up someone, Joseph had to stop them. I told him respectfully that he couldn't be there, and I, I honestly was hoping to maybe have a conversation with him about his cool boat. Uh, but yeah, it completely went the other way. AJ Thakor owns the boat. He's also known as Ace Rogers on social media. CBS 8 has done stories about his philanthropy and business, but that's not the Ace Joseph met yesterday. It escalated immediately. It was zero to 100 immediately. Joseph says Ace threatened his life. It's pretty serious. What do you mean he was threatening your life? Uh, he was saying I will kill you, like over and over and over. <laughs> Someone even posted video of it to YouTube. Joseph says Ace gets out his wallet and continues his vicious tirade toward him as he throws $100 bills at him and into the water. I'm a minimum wage worker and he was commenting on... He was saying that? Yeah, on my status of who I am just because of my job. He was saying uh, I'm nobody, I'm nothing, I, I work a silly job. He said that he knows people, he has connections, and he can change my life and ruin it. You can see Joseph standing on the dock as the boat pulls away. I didn't really even know how to process it. I really was just trying to restrain myself from potentially getting fired from my job or, you know, just stepping out of line. I, the only thing I did was give him the bird. You can see that on the video, too, but it's what Ace did next that Joseph says upset him most. He had dropped his pants and started uh, to make gestures at everybody that was watching and me. You can't act that way in public, and it's, it's just not okay, especially threatening my life at the very least. You know, um, there's women and children there. That, that's the most important part. Yeah, I actually got video and pictures from several people this afternoon. A lot of people saw this happen. Now, this afternoon, I did get a statement from Ace Rogers. Here's what it says. Quote, the interaction that occurred yesterday was regrettable. What started as a minor misunderstanding escalated into an argument, and I apologize for my actions and those who witnessed the unfortunate exchange. Live out here at the marina right next to Seaport Village, I'm Anna Laurel for CBS 8. Guys. Well, Joseph is saying that his life was threatened. Did Harbor Police get involved? Yeah, you know, I spoke with Harbor Police earlier today. They were going to look into it, and late this afternoon, they told me that they did respond to a report of a possible intoxicated vessel operator. Um, but by the time they got here, uh, that Lamborghini yacht was long gone. About 10 minutes later is when they arrived. They did say, we strongly encourage people to be respectful of others and lawfully enjoy their time on and around San Diego Bay.